everyone, my name is Buddha Tongzi, and welcome back to part two of episode two of Genshin Impact, where we last left off. We have scattered around the areas to locate the locations of the treasure, and we have finally found the, uh, the buried treasure, which is in this location right over here. And as you can see, this little entrance with some wind pulling into it. That means it's the entrance. So, now that we are here at the location and I am collecting all of these crabs for no doubt future cooking, we're gonna go in here, we're gonna get this treasure. This see must if it's be true. the Arcadian ruins. Yes, it must be. Is it just me? Or does it look plain? I mean, it's a cave. What did you expect? Oh, Paimon gets it. The perfect disguise is always in plain sight. I guess you could say that. Kaya's grandpa sure is impressive. Someone's definitely in there. Oh, mice! <laughs> that could not have been mice. That is too heavy for mice. Not even rats. Uh, it's no time to get suspicious. We're close. Hurry, the treasure is waiting for us. Oh, Paimon, you're, you're adorably innocent, but I... Mm. Recommended... No, re no, recommended elements. Ice and electro. Okay. So... I guess, in a way, this could be a good time to use different characters, so... Let's ke and keep Amber just in case if we need the range, and let's swap our one for finding ore with this character. Actually, no. My viewers didn't really get to see this one in action, so... Let's swap Amber out. Yeah, I feel like that'd be a good idea. And if we ever have to burn anything, then... Oh, are you taking me out? Maybe we'll be able to in the middle of it. I don't... I might regret it afterwards, because I won't be able to burn anything, but I figured we... no one got to see, like, Ning Guang in action in my last episode, so why not? Well, in part one. Here we are. Okay. Oh, got some interesting guy up ahead. You know what? Let's use this character right now and oh, show him off. I'll show her off. First off, I found out she can do this. What? I, 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 I thought that was a wall. blood. Okay, you're a dick. I thought that was a protective wall, because the last time I used it, the enemies didn't seem to want to go by it. Hold on. No, I don't want to do that. I'm already an idiot. What What does it do? Jade screen. Jade's a jade screen out of gold, obsidian, and her great opulence dealing AoE geo damage. Blocks enemy pro Oh, it blocks projectiles. Ow! So you know what? Don't waste my time. Use it. This. Ah, ah, that's right. That's right. That's right. Boom! 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 Ha! Cool it. Oh, so sorry. Ah! Oh god. Okay. Place is a little more hectic than usual. Wait, that. Oh, right. Fired. Woo! Ha! Nice job hitting your own. Happy! A piece of poo. 
It was in the middle of showing the door opening. That was crap. Okay. Gee, thanks, game. Thanks for pushing me off of the edge with a cutscene. Okay, so warning of those slimes, they like to explode. This looks like a room for fighting. Oh, is this the end? Doesn't look it. Where are you, my treasure? Let's look around. <laughs> I'll save you the trouble. How about you let me take over? You're the guy who listened in on the conversation. Sharp eye, but too slow. I'm Izzard. Izzard? I thank you both on behalf of the <coughs> treasure hoarders. <clears throat> uh, we've been keeping a low profile. How did word get out? <laughs> Low profile, huh? I don't know. Maybe the out loud speaking little floating fairy girl should explain why she blabbered out loud and loudly to the adventurer guild member of where we were going and looking for. Hmm. Paimon won't let you have the treasure without a fight. You would be wise not to underestimate us. My gang is just outside waiting for my order. Okay. However, they're not as, uh, sociable as me. And? I have abilities, which I'm sure I can wipe the floor with you guys. I'm sorry to rain on your parade. But your gang won't be participating in your current plan. If you'd like to ask why, you can go see them. In Mondstadt Prison. Or perhaps you'd prefer to join them permanently. The Knights. Hi. Hey, it's Kaya. Kaya, he wants to steal your treasure. Get him. Ugh, almost had it. Oh, you mean the treasure. Sorry, but there wasn't any treasure to begin with. What? You came all the way for nothing. Just give it up. What? I thought that was something odd about the whole sword being so powerful thing. No treasure? Did Kaya just say there isn't any treasure? Yes, he said there's no treasure. Ha! <laughs> you got me good. Didn't think the knights would resort to such tactics. I mean, anyone would use any type of tactics depending on the situation. A thief has no right to criticize the methods of the Knights of Fav Wait, what are you- You're not gonna get me! Seriously, he did like a jogging run. You could have sprinted and tackled the guy. Okay, oh god. Whoa, what is this? I didn't mean it. Oh, I regret everything. Did it just attack and dance? What a troublemaker. Oh, you, no. knife! You're not gonna watch me die, are ya? Hmm. What an interesting suggestion. Fine. I I'll confess and go quietly. Please, just help me! Alright then. Guess I will have to do some overtime work after all. Okay, that hurt a little bit. Okay, this is gonna be a little tricky because I don't have Amber in my party. Oh, you gotta be joking. Oh no. No 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 Okay, that was close. Oh, 
Alright. Embarrassing. Having my life saved by a knight. You should be thankful we didn't leave that thing to squish you. Don't forget what you promised. Or that thing will be the least of your worries. Hey, is this how the Knights of Favonius treats the people they catch? Depending on how despicable they are, and you're very despicable for even planning to take someone's family treasure. So I doubt he cares. <laughs> I'm just joking. All right, let's take him back. Sir, yes, sir. <clears throat> uh, Captain, should we take these two in as well? What? Uh, what? <laughs> of course not. They are the ones who made this arrest possible. Without them spreading our fabricated intel, we wouldn't have been able to catch the treasure hoarders. Her face doesn't really show expression of actually crying. That looks weird to me. All right, all right. Stop it already. <clears throat> Though the treasure doesn't exist, you did want it for yourself, didn't you? Otherwise, you would have informed me of your intentions, no? Just a sec. You did help me out, so you do deserve a reward. What's the reward? This is the triumphant Harbinger of Dawn that points towards victory. As its name suggests, it symbolizes light and victory. If you don't mind, I would like to present you with this Harbinger of Dawn as a reward. Harbinger of Dawn? That's right. It suits a well-cultured and disciplined person such as yourself. Wouldn't you say, Paimon? Well, if the reward is this Harbinger of Dawn... You'd forgive me, right? I'm honored to have such an understanding friend. Yes, yes. You have my apologies for the deception. I will not use the same method twice. I say Paimon has been charmed. What a surprise that you solved the puzzles all by yourself and arrived before me. So it was you who left all those clues? Indeed. However, even I believed the clues were too vague to be of any help to you. I was prepared to answer your questions. Yeah, but I mean, they weren't really hard to discover myself, so there was no need to a ask questions. Quite impressive. This was the only thing that I did not anticipate in the entire operation. Ha! That was nothing! I will say that, like, not to toot my own horn, but that was kind of a cakewalk to solve those map puzzles. In one. No matter what you say, I acknowledge your wisdom. After all, wisdom itself does not deceive. Depends. But some people do enjoy <clears throat> deceiving others with their wits. He gets it. <laughs> what a wonderful day. Now, I have to go interrogate my suspect. Please excuse me. Do come visit me at our headquarters when you have the chance. Okay. Is that really it for this place, though? Oops, secret pirate treasure. Hey! At least I do get a treasure chest. Girl's Wits, and Teachings of Freedom. Okay, so I got some rewards in the end still. I say that was a win-win. There's all these staircases for no reason. Alright, so, we solved the mystery of the treasure. There is no treasure, except for that treasure chest that I just opened. There's no sword of ultimate power. But this Harbinger, Harbinger of Dawn, I want to 
look at quickly. Let me see, like... Is this, like, a weapon they gave me? Oh, yeah! It, it is. It's the... It's the sword I already have. <laughs> Gee, thanks for giving me something I already have equipped. Alright, so... Um... I'm actually gonna end off... Uh, this video short right here, being that that is the end of part two of the second episode of Genshin Impact. But, we're not done yet. Do not worry. We have more to do. We have actually one more other thing to do, which is return to Mondstadt for the quest called Shadow over Mondstadt. So, in the next episode, we're going to start that quest. So I hope you guys are looking forward to it as I am. And of course, I'll make sure my characters are healed up and all their gear and all that is completely set up for that time when it comes. So I hope you guys look forward to that episode. Again, I say that repeatedly over and over. I know I do that a lot. I am sorry. But with that being said, thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed the video. And of course, for newcomers to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and ding the bell so that you guys can stay notified of the content that uploads onto it so that you guys can see it on the time that it does. And as always, I'll see you all in the next video. Take care, and all you please have a wonderful day. Bye, everyone. It's delicious.